Well, I was lucky enough to be sitting uh, first off uh, with Gina Miles and the commentary booth and then sitting down here for the second half with the riders in the finish tent and I'm in shock. I cannot believe how tough this course road. Like I just took a picture of the scoreboard because I've never seen one like this and um, if you had told me this was going to happen on Friday, I would have said, you got to be kidding me. Because actually, I thought the course walked great. And, I mean, uh, you know, I think Derek's done a great job. And it's very interesting to see that the problems have been all over the course. It wasn't one one certain fence. So um, it's going to be very interesting to see tomorrow. There's, I don't know, like maybe 20 horses left. So, yikes. Yeah, I mean, that's my guess. I haven't counted. But there's not that many left. Well, I mean, the ones that went around great went around great. William Fox Pitt, Will Coleman, um, Marilyn, they looked amazing. But, I mean, the problems, I, it's, I mean, all over the course, it's, it's very bizarre. <laughs> I don't think you can just pinpoint it to one thing. Like, like I said, the problems were all over the course, you know. So, you know, there was a lot more, uh, like, first-timers here, both for horse and rider. So that might have had something to do with it also. Yeah, I mean, some of them just popped off also. So it's just, I mean, there was problems spread out all over. It was bizarre. <laughs> yes, I would have loved to have been on gin and juice right now. Um, but, you know, things happen for a reason, so maybe I wasn't supposed to go here. They have Peter Barry. Hello. He was awesome. Awesome. I'm so proud of him. But, um, I thought he looked super. Looked amazing. Uh, I've never really sat down and watched him ride, so it's very, very exciting. Um, it's unfortunate for Diana, and um, Jess had a great go, too. So if we can get that dressage, <laughs> you know, she's, she's looking good. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I like I honestly from the first rider out watching the best cross country rider in the world. I mean, yes, he was on a green horse, but I mean, literally the people's faces in the like the tent with the riders. I mean, they went white to see. You know, like uh, they were a little bit worried, and it rode tough. It rode really tough. Yeah. Um, we are heading up Monday, going to go to Cheslin Farm to Bruce Davids Davidson's and hang out there for a week with Buck and then Jersey Fresh and then back to Buck's place and then Bromont and then Davids and training camp. Well, I'm not saying the O word. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah.